Equity Bank Group has recorded a 21% growth in profit for the first quarter of 2023, which saw the lender make 12.8 billion shillings in profit compared with 11.9 billion shillings during the same period last year. This comes as the bank subsidiary in the DRC is pro projected to outperform the Kenyan business in the next five years. Jimmy Mbogo takes us through the lender's performance for the first quarter of 2023. Kenyans are moving away from physical bank transactions. According to Equity Bank, 98% of all transactions are happening away from the banking hall. Now, the bank, which released its first quarter result this Tuesday, says that 96% of transactions are happening on third-party and self-service platforms, with 70% of all transactions happening digitally. Uh, the transactions include loan application and processing, with 87% of loans being processed through mobile platforms. Uh, the bank says this is driven by a demographic shift, a factor that has seen the bank heavily increase its investment in staff pushing up its cost-to-income ratio. People want digital payment. It's no longer about devices. It's enable me to do what I want to do without ever touching cash. As we have seen, the business itself has transformed. The skills that uh, we required ha now are diversified. We need more our skills. So that has seen us um, significantly improve our skills. Staff costs aside, the bank says the rising cost of interest on the global market has led it to spend more on interest payments due to repricing. A look at interest expense. Uh, grows by 47% because of repricing of the loans that we had borrowed globally, which we used to pay 3%, but we are now paying 9%. A quick look at the Kenyan Bank and auditor results as of 31st March 2023 indicates that the bank's assets stood at 903 billion shillings compared to 841.9 billion shillings in Q1 of 2022, while the lenders earning from government securities declined to 9.38 billion uh, this year, down from 12.5 billion in Q1 of 2022, as the bank divests away from government securities. Uh, the bank earned 11.8 billion shillings in Q1 of 2023 from its loan disbursement, up from 10.4 billion shillings from a similar period last year. The reason why the loan book is growing in uncertain times is because our customers require an umbrella when it is raining. We can't take away the umbrella from our customers when they need it most. At the same time, the lender spent 7.8 billion shillings on interest expenses for Q1 of 2023 compared to 5.1 billion shillings in 2022. Uh, the bank's operating expenses also grew from 8.2 billion shillings in Q1 of 2022 to stand at 11.8 billion shillings in Q1 of 2023. As banks continue to diversify their investment for equity bank, it is the investment in the insurance sector that they are hoping will be able to maintain the bank's growth and ensure continuity of their business. Jimmy. It is estimated that Kenya loses about 100 billion shillings in counterfeit trade. This is according to the latest, latest in.